going to make that MCP panel just a bit smaller there. There we go. So connected and bypass pin inserted. Release parking brake. Okay, releasing the parking brake. Starting pushback. See, so he's got uh, the jetways that are going away from the uh, airplane. We're going to delay engine start. Oh, beautiful airport. Yeah, you can tell it's much smaller than the 800. heat particle effect coming out of the APU. Wow. Look at that guy out there walking around. That's awesome. There it is. Vertical Simulations Corpus Christi right there. Get it while it's hot. Yep, PVD is very nice for sure. Supposedly there's an Easter egg around here. We may need to go find that. Someone said it was... I think Vertical said it was in a hangar or something. So we do need to find the Easter egg today. Near Coast Guard C-130... I'm tempted to go look at it right now. All right. Let's do it. Oh, quick preview. We're going to do a more in-depth preview. <gasps> Operation complete. Set parking brake. Set the parking brake. I'll set that in a second. I can set it now. Maybe. Disconnecting tow. Stand by. I'm going to find it. Maybe it's inside. Oops. That's the hangar. That that isn't the hangar. Other side maybe? Okay. No. Oh, oh there we go. Here we go. <laughs> oh yeah, look at that. Oh, disconnect, go to hand signals. That is classic. Thank you, Vertical. Fly Snack Air. Brad M. likes pizza on Thursdays only. And Cloudy Box 737. Max release. Date. 2029. <laughs> oh, that's awesome. Toe is disconnected and bypassed. I and love has it. Been removed. All right. Hand signal Again, will be we're going to take... Right. Next time We're going to take have a great flight. another, a very close, a very, very detailed look at the airport later on after we do a couple of approaches. But I need, do need to get back inside here. Alright, we're going to go AP, or, uh, packs off. <laughs> That's awesome. Alright, packs are off. And we're going to go start number two. Come down here. And we're going to add fuel here in just a moment. <laughs> Very nice. Did I get the IAS slash mock fixed? Well, for the 737-700, the, the mock speed is working. But for the max, it's not. I haven't fixed that yet, no. I do like it vertical. Yeah, that's awesome. Okay. Add in the fuel. Just picked up CRP, last two digit orders, last two digit number zero one. All right. 
exclamation add J Kraus. Let's give him 1,500 snacks for buying KCRP. Congratulations. Anyone else would like to purchase KCRP, they will give the last digit of their order number and you will qualify for 1,500 snacks. <laughs> yeah. Uh, does last night count? Um, I, I will give you, I will give you 444, Fokker. For last night's purchase. All right, let's start number one. Mostly a little higher than expect because of the 4K Ultra High Def Professional Grade 0 0.5 Resolution Ortho. Makes sense. Okay, adding fuel. Ozebo. Okay, let that start up. Who do you who do you buy ortho from? Maybe I I have, I don't even know how how you would buy ortho, but to me personally, because I generate my own, the only ortho I want from an airport scenery developer is typically inside the runways, runways into the terminals and areas. Outside of it, I don't want it, but I can understand why a lot of people don't have the ortho and want the ortho there. So. Paris Global Corp will sell it. Well, we need to find out the price for Eugene. <laughs> we need to find out the price for Eugene area, Oregon. Might be pricey. Okay, or sorry, Gen 1, Gen 2 on. Let's go ahead and put the probe heat on. And we're also going to put on the uh, electric and engine hydraulic pumps A. APU bleed can come off. Isolation valve to auto. And let's do taxi light. We should have had any collision on already. Okay, anything? I'm. Um, oh yeah, we can do engines to continuous. And we're gonna also do uh, flaps five. Yeah, I'm curious what Eugene would be. Okay, we can arm. Yeah, Elnav and Arn. Arn uh, Elnav and Arnav are not uh, arming yet. Padawan. Yeah, it's a. It is a sexy aircraft for sure. Okay, I'm going to look at the airport diagram. Okay, we're going to taxi out to... Yeah, we'll go out that way. Okay, parking brake released. Uh, we're just going to fly out of Corpus Christi. We're going to fly east of Corpus Christi out to a, a waypoint called Copa. Copan, I think. And then we're going to come back in and do the RNAV RMP Zulu back into Corpus Christi. That's the current plan.
Padawan. I, I, Snack Air wants Eugene someday <laughs> from someone, <laughs> and that's why I was, that's why I was referencing, um, how I wonder how much it costs for Eugene Ortho because I want, I want Eugene. FS Economy Auto Login. I also would like Tulsa, Colorado Springs, Flagstaff. But I think, you know what, to be to be fair, and by the way, vertical simulations, I don't know, I, I'm assuming you did a lot of recon on the uh, ortho, the, the, the satellite imagery of the airport, so I imagine these textures are very, very, very much like the real world um, Corpus Christi. And I really do like the ortho here outside of the taxiways. That's pretty cool. Just Jeff is dying for Eugene. I'd love to get real pictures if anyone wants to develop it. Yeah. Uh, the, yeah, I really want a Eugene. I think a Boise would also be welcome. Yeah. Um, I think that any airport designer um, should probably focus on Charlie, Class Charlie and Class Bravo airports. Um, because, you know, th those are going to be your big bang for your buck. And Vertical Simulation says that's correct. A lot, a lot of watching landing and takeoff bids. See? He did his home. Um, the, uh, The, um, yeah, so Class Bravo, Class Charlie, I think, are, you know, we're missing a lot of Class Charlie and a lot of Class Bravo airports to pay wear grade. Eugene is not a Class Charlie, right? I don't think. Is it? Or is it? Is Eugene a Class Charlie? I've got to, I've got to, I think it's a Delta. Someone needs to look on Sky Vector for me right now. Is Eugene a Charlie? I should know this. I don't think it is. Um, anyway. Um, yeah, C and B in the pilot edge. Car I would love for, yeah, for us to have every... In fact, I mean, if we're just looking for genie in the bottle type wishes, you know, the genie comes out of the Jameson bottle and says, I grant you three wishes. Well, one of my wishes is to have every airport on pilot edge be pay work quality. Pay work available. <laughs> That would be awesome. All right, I don't think I can taxi down there. Now, is this a problem vertical on my end? Or did I do, is there something wrong? Because there must be, I must have added these, right? I'm assuming this is not a part of, this is probably my overlay that's doing these trees. I'm assuming that that's my overlay. Okay, you think it's on my end? Okay, so it's it's my it's my overlay. How do you edit overlay? Can I do that in like overlay editor? I, I'm gonna have to do a um, an intersection departure. Yeah. Okay. So it is a class delta. Yeah. Maybe an overlay editor. I can remove those trees. I know an overlay editor. I can remove. I can remove static aircraft and other objects, but I don't know if I can. Re I've never, I've never even tried to do trees. Now, do I do? Maybe I do exclusion zones. Hmm. You can remove roads in the overlay editor, so maybe you can do trees. I've never even thought about that. Someone here knows the answer to the question. All right, I'm gonna hold short here. Hopefully, I have enough runway. It's gonna be tight. All right, let's go up here. Let's do uh, lights on, taxi light off. Engines can stay on continuous, strobe and steady. Cleared for departure. Cleared for departure. Uh, we're going to arm the auto throttle. Thank you. Uh, anything else that we need? I think we're good to go. APU is on. You're right. So APU bleed is off. APU can go off. Thank you. Everything else looks good. 
Oh, T A R A. There are vids on YouTube how to remove trees from taxis and runways. Okay. Excellent. All right. Let's line up and wait. Let's bring on a little bit of sound. Or a lot of sound. Headphone users beware. Keep in mind that Corpus Christi iCow is KCRP. What do you mean? Oh man, this is going to be a short runway. I think I might need to back taxi actually. Uh, maybe not. Alright, don't try this in the real world, but I'm actually going to spool up and not release the brakes for just a little bit.